is your first time thank you so much for clicking please subscribe if this is not your first time thank you so much for coming back so we're going to be styling cycle shorts today so if you call this side class because that's what i used to call it when i was in high school cycle shorts are tight but they are shorts basically that's what it is yeah, the first time i saw cycle shorts actually being worn as a fashion staple was on kim kardashian i was like where is she even going to with this like it looks like something you know you went to work out or you it just didn't look like a serious look at all it looked like one of those high experiments she was doing with Kanye's pieces and stuff so i was like mm, whatever and then i started seeing a couple other people wearing it and then it just has this playful vibe about it and i was like okay this is something we can actually wear especially now that it's really warm any excuse to wear something shall sure we embrace it so i got a pair and then i tried to style it in some ways and i thought you know why not share it with you guys it's something that is kind of a trend and then there's some people obviously like when you see a lot of people wearing something you feel like wearing it even if you don't want to follow trends so you just want to make it your own and wear it so i just want to give you guys a few ideas on how to style your cycle shirt so the first tip the guys thing. is um don't take yourself too seriously it's a fun piece like it's not something you wear to a formal meeting or a business meeting or even something you know remotely serious <laughs> to be honest you can wear um, cycle shorts so maybe the mall you know to run around like on the saturday i went to do my nails went to buy some um, hair products went to the mall to exchange something as a mom as well if you can if you're going to take your kids out and then you want to be able to run to chase them maybe taking them to the mall or a soft play area you know wearing cycle shorts would actually be very very appropriate for that kind of outing because like you're 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 looking fun and then you're you're able to run around in just a playful cute way so tip yeah is to buy one that is a bit longer don't let it like be so short because you might be so uncomfortable wearing it so yeah just buy one that maybe just get to your knee itself and then the the top of it can be high as well so maybe just like a high-waisted cycle shorts yeah, and then like um, the third tip would maybe go for a darker color probably something like black black is always easy or gray or like um tan So it covers your bum. So if you're fully figured, I suggest you wear it with this um, kind of long, big hoodie. So you can see it's really free, it's really playful. I folded the arms because I don't like the length of this one. Like when you're feeling yourself, don't mind showing your curves and your bum and all that. Yeah, you can see this one is shorter, it's here, so your hips, everything. Another reason I actually stuck with black is that black just makes everything look effortless. Like it's just like you just wore something, wore something. If you've seen some from Fiery wearing this black outfit, you think it's actually like a play suit that's just tight and stuff. You know, it just makes it look fun and all that. So yeah, just in case you don't want to go for black, you can always go with a different color of hoodie. So this is this um, camo one. It's free as well. It's really long. It covers your bum, covers your hips. And yeah, this is a way to roll as well. You can also see there's black in it, so it doesn't look too, you know, shouty. It's just like a bit calm. So another way to wear it is by wearing a shirt. As you can see, I'm wearing this silky shirt. It's a vintage shirt. It's a Ghani one. I bought it from a vintage store and I really love it. So this shirt, um, I don't know, it just makes you look a bit more serious and a bit more grown up than the hoodie look. This is the third way and most likely the most serious way you can actually wear your cycle shorts. Um, I've paired this with a top. This is just a see-through top. It's quite long, so it's got details at the back. Yeah. It's got details. Lovely detail showing, and then I paired it with a jacket. So this is just a free and loose jacket. And yeah, you have your cycle shorts underneath. I'm also wearing a pair of boots just to show, you know, we're trying to be serious with our cycle shorts. So I'm just going to show you guys. <laughs>
three ways I've styled my cycle shorts and these are the three ways you can style your cycle shorts some people actually wear crop top with these like those very loose fitting crop tops that actually you know hang here if you're really fit and you think you want to be daring with styling your cycle shorts that's probably a way to wear and then you should check out my friend um, Nelly Suji her channel she also styles cycle shorts in fact she was one that actually made me start doing this so check out her channel and then uh, get inspired as well so that's it with the ways I styled my cycle shorts I hope you guys enjoyed the like button if you enjoyed this video subscribe if you haven't and see you on the next episode bye bye